We're at LA Fitness, we're going to do a German body composition workout, which is a nice big full body workout, lactate style training, so it's high reps, very short rest periods, very slow eccentric movements. So what Sam's going to do is he's going to make sure that I only take 60 seconds rest between my squat and my dumbbell press. He's also going to count my eccentric tempo, which is four seconds down. So I'm going to take four seconds from the top of the squat to the bottom of the squat and four seconds from the top of the dumbbell press to the bottom. And if somebody's there counting the tempo, it just keeps it nice and strict. It means your form doesn't get sloppy. Definitely harder. Most people in the gym are always lowering the weights far too quickly. So uh, as soon as you start to like really fight the descent, that's when it starts to hurt and starts to get difficult. And we're going to go uh, upper body, lower body, upper body, lower body, get the big compound exercises in and then move to shoulders, arms and abs to finish off. Uh, the rest periods are going to decrease as we move through the workout. So as the exercises get less and less neurologically complex, uh, the rest periods are going to decrease. Uh, and we're looking for 12 to 15 reps on each exercise. So uh, it's quite high reps and moderate weight. It's definitely an aerobic element to it because your heart rate is elevated the whole time. Uh, I'd say it's many of the lactate response that's produced from the high reps and the slow movements. The idea being that improved or increased blood lactate increases your growth hormone levels naturally, which is a good pathway to enhanced fat loss definitely hurts, especially the larger exercises. Trying to mix chin-ups with squats and lunges and bench presses uh, with short rest periods gets quite uncomfortable. Okay, what a lovely start. Yeah, 60 seconds. So, rotating dumbbell press. 10 seconds, five seconds, four, three, two, one. Up we go. One, two, three, Four, that's one. One, two, three, four, two. It's a lactate inducing program. So the concept is that you get increased growth hormone production via increase of blood lactate levels. So that's one pathway to achieving greater fat loss. So it's basically a fat loss program. The idea being that you can lose fat without doing cardio. You just adjust your diet suitably and train properly with weights. Three, four, seven. Two, three, four, that's yes. eight. One, two, three, four, that's nine. <laughs> one, two, three, four, stand. Two to go. One, two, three, four. Nice, last one. Two, three, four, up we go. Beautiful. Pump on already. Nice. Oh, all right, back to squats. 15 second rest now. <clears throat> Ready, here we go. 25 seconds rest now. 15, 10 seconds, James. Ready, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Do it, set. 2, 3, it's quite a painful program. Um, most of the tempos are controlled. Uh, there's a tempo prescription, uh, which is again is something that Charles Poliquin has uh, given us, um, which is usually a four second eccentric. So that means um, you take four seconds to lower the weight um, and you take about one second to raise the weight. So that slow eccentric movement creates uh, a lot of lactic acid and it makes what would normally be a moderate weight feel particularly heavy or a light weight feel moderately heavy. So um, it's not about shifting heavy weights or being macho. Um, it's about um, getting a sweat on. Ten, last two. Two, three, four, last one. Come on. One, two, three. Beautiful. Good stuff. Ten seconds. Five seconds, James. Three, two, one. Let's do it. One, two, three, four. Here we go. One, one, two, three, four. Two, one, two, three, four. Here we go. Three, one, two, three, four. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Here we go. One, Two, three, four, that's five, come on. Two, three, four, we go six. One, 
two, three, four, seven. One, two, three, four, eight. One, two, three, four. We go nine, three more. One, two, three, four. We go three, good. Three, four, two more. Come on. Two, yep. Four, last one. Come on. One, two, good. Dumbbell lunges followed by signature chin ups. Thirty seconds rest is gone. Fifteen seconds. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Off we go. Your heart rate's elevated the whole time. Um, the longest rest periods you get in the whole workout is 60 seconds. Drops down to 30 seconds by the time you get to the last couple of supersets. All the exercises are done in supersets. Uh, so you have um, four supersets. You have um, a couple of big leg exercises, compound moves, um, a big rowing exercise, some kind of pull, some kind of pushing movement, like a bench press, um, and then including some abs, arms and shoulders in there, so really hitting the full body. So the idea is that you're eliciting a lactate response from every muscle in the body and trying to get the biggest growth hormone response possible. I'm one week out of the show at the moment, so um, there's not much more I can do with my body at the moment other than perhaps dehydrating a little bit and just trying to get as much rest as possible and keep the stress off my body. Uh, the idea being that your body holds water and inflammation if it's stressed. So the best thing to do in the last few days is probably to actually rest and not overwork yourself. <laughs> Grip's gone. Woo! We've got 10 reps. <sighs> okay. 15 seconds. 10 seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's do it. Oh. 
Oh, so, military press and dumbbell curl. One. on this. Three, one, two, three. 
three. One, two, three, five. One, two, three, six. One, two, three, five. One, two, three, eight. One, two, three, nine. One, two, three, ten. One, two, one, two, three, twelve. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Here we go. Two, three, one. Two, three, two. Two, three, three. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. Three, six. Seven. Come on. Eight. I'm asking you body comp. I've been working hard, invested a lot of time and uh, money in it. Training, eating, thinking. Um, yeah, I can't wait to bring it on.